Hello, hello, my beautiful, wonderful collectives. Welcome to my channel. This is me, Slavic. Good to see everybody. And welcome the guests of my channel as well. And if you're new, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Do it now. Don't forget to click that notification button so you don't miss my next videos. All right, my wonderful collectives. I decided to do another reading. Another reading. Let's spill the tea. Let's spill the tea. Let's dive in more about this whole unprecedented corruption that, of course, unwillfully, without consent, you were brought in. Okay, so who is at fault? What happened? Key players? Any other relevant information we need to know right now about this unprecedented corruption let's see who's responsible for this corruption and abuse of power and authority what is this about water sign masculine coming up first thing male male money hungry money hungry obsessed so we have here a masculine he comes up as a water sign he doesn't have to be it's an individual that wanted some sort of chance wanted some sort of money, wanted stability, wanted increase of finances, okay? What else can you tell me about this person? Justice card, an individual who's supposed to represent justice, who's supposed to act according to the higher standards, ethics, and morals of our judicial system is a crook. Is a corrupt, money hungry, immoral, unethical crook. The, he is the reason. Okay, he is the reason. Because the cards clearly shows corruption, obstructions, miscarriage of justice, abuse of power and authority because that individual wanted financial gain. Wanted money wanted money what else about this corrupt unethical person he could be in fact a water sign matter of fact very emotional immature impatient cannot regulate his emotions i have promotions under the table huh well isn't it fun isn't it fun some corrupt representative of the law and the judicial branch carries the logo of the law whether it's on his badge or on his certificate wanted promotions now what kind of promotions lawful promotions you think i don't think so I think that this male wanted promotions and that promotion was under the table. You see? So that, that's your obstruction of justice. This person was promoted under the table. And due to uh, taking into consideration that his personality comes up as a water sign, very weak. I see FBI, Interpol, CSIS, whoever he is. So this is, could be connected to some sort of special unit, special forces unit, FBI unit, CIA, CSIS. I, I could be Interpol, but I'm going to stick with it locally. So he got promoted. He got, got promoted in a special forces, some sort of special investigation. Perhaps an investigation that never taken place before. But that was under the table. It's like, here, I got a job for you. And all you have to do is be corrupt. That, that's the promotion, right? Promotions under the table. Promotions under the table. And this individual connected to some sort of special unit. Military, police, um, who else? Some sort of level, higher up level there. Wanted promotions, okay? That's a new job for him. It was a new beginning. So he was quite eager. 
quite eager to get that corrupt promotions. Who promoted him? Who promoted this person? Who gave him this offer? Who promoted him? Who else? There's somebody else above him. <clears throat> Who promoted this water sign under the table? Who promoted this person under the table? We have offer here. Ace of Cups offer. Okay. We have the vehicle, the chariot. Very strong movement. It was promising. I have Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, some other potentially material, materialistic female. Materialistic gold digging female. She doesn't come up necessarily as a pentacle uh, as a as a queen of pentacles. But she so it came from a female. Female that loves money. That loves money. Um contribute. She loves good life. She's actually is a fire sign female, okay? So there is a fire sign female who appointed, promoted under the table, illegally, unlawfully, this person. They were a team together, okay? So this pro promotion came from a female. Now, uh, I do see here a documents, documents being cooked, plotted, fraud it so she either specifically you know dr drag his application ignore all the other potential applicants for this new job and uh you know uh with all due respect i i have a lot of respect to a decent law abiding officers of the law and the judicial branch it's just not fair in my opinion this is not fair to give favors. To give favors. This whole thing was a favor. Corruption. So maybe other potential applicants that wanted the same job, working for this uh, big unit, big investigative unit like FBI, CIA, whatever it is, military, whatever that is, whatever that branch is, um, they were in a good standing. They served incredibly with passion and integrity to our communities and our society. Who Who is this dude? What service did he had? But they were together in it. They were either friends, knew each other. I will take a look exactly what connects these two. But they were in it together, okay? It was promotions under the table. Promotions under the table that uh, involved nothing but corruption. Nothing but corruption. What is the relationship between this uh, fire sign female, even though she came up as a gold digger, loves money, fake? See, there's a two fakes here. She could be red hat, could have been a red hat. At that time of this corrupt promotion, she had uh, brown burgundy hair, okay? Burgundy brown hair. Same color as this specific hair, okay? And there's this man right beside her together. Together. What is the relationship between these two? Are they co-workers? Are they colleagues? How is that allowed, this promotion? She's a privileged woman. So she holds some sort of position of privilege. She uh, perceives herself in a community as very privileged. Or maybe maybe community sees her as very special, privileged. She lives in a nice house. She, she drives a beautiful, expensive vehicle. It's most likely white vehicle. Um, I don't know what kind of white, fancy vehicle, Cadillacs, you name it. Tesla, maybe, but it's, uh, I get a color white. So she is very privileged. She has a nice home. She has nice, nice, expensive clothing. She has a beautiful home with a beautiful garden. And community seen her as a privileged, 
privileged person. It's a person that holds some sort of authority. So, and, and of course, relevantly, she wants to keep that authority. She's from the distance from you, by the way. And of course, in order for her to keep that authority, that privileged status, that, that status that she obtains through fraud, through abusing her power of authority, she picks, handpicks her minions. Oh, I'm going to send this water sign, dude, because I know he's a corrupt. <laughs> We're a team. So, you know how it works, right? A typical corruption where everybody picks those whom they can trust so they could continue on being in power. But thieves, thieves, liars, abusers, abusers, they do not serve community they serve themselves they serve themselves and this corruption must end and this corruption matter of fact will end you understand how it works promotions you do me a favor i'll do you a favor okay we're we're a team here still ending no matter how well i'll, I'll pull into it Two corrupt officials connected to law. Law, military, policing. Appoint crooks. What else can you tell me about this corruption? Psychopaths. They're, 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 they're liars. It's a, they're both psychopaths. Two psychopaths. Pathological liars, abusers, they not only abuse their power and authority, but they have that tendency of being tyrants. Tyrants, this is not what democracy is about. This is not how those in a position of authority that enjoy their corrupt privilege should treat their citizens or people. In general, they're psychopaths that abuse not only their authority but people. They're liars, they're sickos, they're vacos, immoral, corrupt, perjury upon perjury, lies upon lies. They think they rule the judicial system. That they are rulers of this world. Typical psychopaths. Two psychopaths. We have fall. This is, could have happened in fall. Or severely, you, you, the psychopathic attack started to take place in fall for you. I have fall time. So September, October, November. This fall, last fall, a few years ago, fall. But this promotion, in some way, could tend, something happened here in fall, where these psychopaths started to actively plan this whole entire thing. So we have this fire sign. Female appointed some water sign who is a corrupt, who was promoted under the table. And this is supposed to be for their joint benefit. And the level of bias and belittling on you. I just look at this card of thief. And you see these two psychopaths here. Female could be a little bigger built. Male could have mustache, you know, they they took this boy, this innocent boy, and laughing, laughing, laughing their heads off if they're greater than you, that your life isn't worth anything, that you are nothing, but there's somebody, they're so special. They're so special with their wealth. Targeting and innocent. This is what child represent, broken poor, innocent person. And they're laughing, especially this female, redhead, this one 
hysterically laughing like a sickle. What are you laughing at? That you're a corrupt bitch? And you're going to be held accountable, psycho. And those people, this community that you so, according to you, respect and protect, they are now going to demand your prosecution. Because you are a psychopathic liar and abuser. And what these two did is fucked up. But the world has a right to know the truth. And the world will know the truth. The nation will know the truth of how truly sick you are. What else can you tell me? Future. See, in the future. This is what waits for you in the future. The exposure. The exposure. And this is intuition 100%. What I just said is 100%. Government officials. They are government officials. These are government officials. So either this female is a government official or both of them are government officials. They're both sick, corrupt government officials. Because the only thing they ever wanted here is promotions and money. They didn't care who to abuse, but they chosen to abuse a wrong person. They chosen to abuse a wrong person. They have abused many people before and they never got caught. But they have chosen to abuse the wrong person. And that is you, my collectors. What else these two psychopathic liars, cor corrupt government officials wanted? This is how they serve the government, okay? <laughs> this is their service. Well, we don't need that type of service. So get the F out. Get the F out. This is how they serve people. This is how they serve community. Destructions. This is the ending. This is the ending, and this ending is going to take place so unexpectedly for them. They don't even expect it coming. Because, hey, remember, they're privileged. They're above the law. Just because they think they're government officials. Mm -mm. Nope. What else you wanted? Well, they wanted comfortable life. They wanted just to, you know, sit, sit back, don't do nothing. They had big dreams. Big dreams, but neither of these two were competent enough intelligent enough and worthy of what they wanted. They wanted to attract wealth, power, stability in their life artificially. What do I mean by artificially? Through lies and corruption and perjury and falsifying evidence. This is what they wanted. They wanted comfortable life. They wanted promotions. They wanted stability in their life. That's what they wanted. But guess what? Das card comes in. And this is going to be a heavy, heavy ending for you too. Your cycles. Very hardcore. Six of swords and tears. Crying. Misery. What else you thought is going to happen? That you're going to go get away with this lies and corruption and abusing people like they're Muppets of yours? And get away with it? No. Because time is coming. Time is coming. To get you the fuck out of your corrupt, so-called, promoted, under-the-table jobs. You do not belong where you're at. This is not how you serve the law. This is not how you serve the community. This is not how you serve the people. You serve people by example. And that's exactly why every government official, from the cop to a soldier to a lawyer, have a strict code of conduct. 
And if you violate that code of conduct, you get terminated, you get fired, or even sued. Privilege, that is the power that you so enjoy, comes with a great responsibility. And you failed. You failed. Two smart asses, they saw that they can outsmart everybody. And nobody will know the truth. Nobody will know the truth. That's what they saw. So my wonderful collective, Three of Cups, it's your victory. Difficult victory. And you should be proud of yourself. Because you're dealing with the corrupt government officials. Was in a position of authority. Right? Privileged connections. I don't care if they have 30 corrupt connections. Then all 30 will go to prison. Then all 30 will be terminated. It doesn't fucking matter how many. What's matter? That society as whole deserves to know the truth. The society as whole deserves to have a government officials that serves them, not abuse them, that protects them, not inflicting pain, harm, or suffering from small to big, from healthy to ill. This is not the code of conduct of government officials that's supposedly representing the law herself. The dirty, fucked up game that you played, you will be exposed for it. You will be exposed for it. So no that your time of pain is on their way. What else can you tell me about these two crooks? Holiday party networking events. Okay, all right. So they could have uh, discussed this at some sort of party or some sort of networking event or this is, could have been a holiday party. That initially these two linked up, okay? Some sort of event. Event. Music, celebration, people drinking. Uh, it's a networking party. So this is initially how these two uh, linked up, okay? These two crooks, fire sign, female, and this water sign. They attended some sort of party. Because there's a people there. There's a good, good, good music. There's a wine from red to, to white. Tramps in a cocktail. Big venue. Like a hotel of some sort. Hotel. Most likely summertime. Some holiday party. Whatever was that holiday, could be holiday of Independence Day holiday. Independence Day holiday, maybe. Some sort of holiday, important, special event. So they met through this event initially. medical party <clears throat> maybe one of them was a medical doctor maybe this water sign was a medical doctor maybe he was a doctor maybe he was a doctor and it was some sort of party where there was a doctor I don't know <laughs> I don't know what kind of party they have but this was a holiday okay and we had this female who's a government officials and we have a doctor so one of the, these party is a doctor. I want to clarify, is it a female a doctor or a male is a doctor? I kind of feel that, that this is that this is a um, male is a doctor. I clarify. Is a is this water sign in medical field? Is he in medical field? Is he in medical field? Say yes. 
medical field. Is the female in medical field? Is the female also in medical field? No. Is a female uh, works for the judicial system? Does a female work for the judicial system? Yes. Yes. Is this water sign has connection to the judicial system as well? Yes. So he could be like a um, court forensic something, psych forensic psychiatrist, forensic uh, something in forensic something, okay? Like a forensic psychiatry, psychology, neuroscience, um, something of that nature, okay? And they met, like I said, at the party. I don't know what that party was. What else? Making money using your name. And of course, you were just a, you were just a like like a mule to them, you know, uh, a subject of, of making money, a subject of experiment, a tool, you know, just a tool to make money on. Why did these psychopaths have chosen you, uh, to to make money on? Why, why did they sought? that you were a perfect match for their sick, psychopathic, corrupt corruption. Why? Financial difficulties. Financial difficulties. Lack of money, lack of finances. Because remember, they're all about money, right? Gold diggers. That's what makes these two privileged. Money. Security. You didn't have any, no luxury, right? They, The reason why these psychopaths are sought of you, that they're better than you, because their definition of better and how they label people is based on their finances. That's why they're privileged. They're privileged because they have status. And what comes with a status? Money. You, on another hand, when you were victimized and targeted, you were in a difficult financial position. You had no money. And what happens when you don't have money? You have no choice. You have no choice. You, you cannot afford an attorney because you don't have money. You didn't have money. You were barely surviving. You have to understand how psychopaths, narcissistic gold diggers think. How do they think? What is the most important for narcissists? To, to remain in a position of authority. Without money, these two are shit. They're nothing. So relevantly, what benchmark are they using to judge other people? financial stability you have money you're privileged just like these crooks you don't have money you're nothing there's nobody that will support you there is nobody that will protect you it was easy you were an easy target because they discriminated on your marital status material status could be your race could be your gender, could be your spirituality. You understand? That's why. That's why. I have three of cups. And on top of that, no family. No family. Because I do see here you were happy. You, you might have not had a lot of money. You might have not had a lot of money. But you know what? You were happy. You were happy with what you had. They showed me some sort of family in reverse. 
relationship that broke, fall apart. I guarantee you they also contribute to that. The first rule of half psychopaths is trying to target person is they're trying to isolate you. They will try to take away and illuminate, eliminate everybody that is could act potentially for you as a good support. They've taken that support from you. Broken family. Alone. You were simply alone. You had no partner by your side. You had no money in your name. You were absolutely vulnerable and alone. And even if you were happy, because I see you were, at that time you were in re, either in relationship with somebody, but you were so happy. You were so happy to be with this person. And then, and then it's broken. It's broken. Ten of Cups reverse is broken. There's no, no love. There's, there's nothing, no happiness. N nobody to support you. Nobody even to help you. Nobody even to say, you know what? It's okay. Everything will be okay. We'll get through it. You were absolutely alone clarify ten of cups what happened here again ten of pentacles comes up here queen of swords another female here involved another female here involved who was thinking about money or the partner have chosen money and went off with somebody else because there is also promises here to financial growth and you felt betrayed you felt you felt betrayed. You could you couldn't you couldn't realize and find out how how could anybody be so cruel? It was a dark time for you. It's probably still still a dark time for you. But you can realize how could anybody be so so dark. And at that point, you realize that the only thing really that matters in this world is money. But it's not. There is a trait that is so crucial and important and vital to us as a human beings. And that is to remain a human. And the word human comes from the word of humble. To be humble. To be humane to be loving, to be kind. Money is something that will come. But you also got betrayed by some person who chosen money, who also, I'm pretty sure, was promised of financial growth, who was promised under table promotions. So it was a difficult time for you. It was a very difficult time for you, but you know what? You made it. You made it. <clears throat> what else about these cycles? I have meditation. Money was a factor. Oh, of course, it's it's all money. I trusted you. Mm -hmm. The other woman. There was the other woman there. Because we talked about this this masculine black magic backfire. The other woman could have participated in magic. Who knows? Dark magic spells also played role here. But at the end of the day, there is a truth. And that truth that is coming will be a big surprise. You know the truth. The truth will be a big surprise potentially to this other masculine that maybe walked away. Or, or that the community will know the truth about everything that's taking place. In closing, what do you need to know about these people? Temperance. They're observed, I feel like, like in the bucket, in the water. They're watched. Page of Pentacle evidence here. They, they, they cannot escape. They're trapped. They're trapped. See, Hermit. Investigation. They're watched. They're investigated closely this hermit looks up at this lamp at really close right before his face he sees it he sees it everybody knows the truth and look i have eight of swords entrapment 
entrapment, prison, accountability, seven of swords, trying to run away. They don't want to go to jail. They're scared to get caught. These people, they're playing as a fool. Acting as a fool. They want to run away. All of a sudden, you'll see everybody transferring from one department to another. As long as there's no link to this corruption. But it's too late. It's too late. And they will not will be able to run away. They're trying to run away. Still continues on lying and bullshitting and playing stupid of what they did. I have two of cups here and I have three of swords and a broken heart. Six of cups in the past. Whoever caused you problem in the past, if there was another woman involved in your relationship, two of cups, try to build her own happiness upon your pain. The same thing is coming back to her too. Nothing but pain and suffering. Nobody is escaping from what was done to you in the past. No one. You stand your garden. Uh, you stand your guard. Page of Swords. You, 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 you are ready. You are ready to defend yourself and fight for truth. At any given time. I also have your Ace of Cups. And the universe giving you all the resources that you require. Okay. All right, my wonderful collectors. This is the reading I have for you. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye.